Discovered waterfall cave. All right, there you go. All the regions of the coast. Somehow. All the regions of the coast. Somehow. You know, I just can't put my finger on it, but I feel like there's been a region I haven't gone to yet. I just don't know. I just don't know what this feeling is. It seems really bizarre. All right. Guys, get closer. I want to... Get you all. Oh, I didn't get coal. That's too bad. Which is way too bad. So anyway, let's go. Well, I guess we can go down the list of stupid bullshit. Uh, there was this one video I saw. It actually, turns out it was from a couple of years ago. I actually thought it was very recently because, like, well, I did see a video posted that was posted this year. Like, uh, I don't, I don't remember if it was like this month or last month or whatever. But it seemed like, oh wow, this is a new video. They're stupid, it's good. They got it all on camera like they recorded themselves. Uh, but no, it turns out uh, there's actually a video that was from like 2013. So I don't know why the person decided to re-upload it. Or, like someone else re-upload it, but well, whatever. So anyway, there was this one video. I don't know what happened. I don't know what the dealio is for them being pulled over, right? But what happened was, like, there's this girl in the car. She was recording the whole thing mm, in all its glory. Uh, and she's the dumb fuck. Uh, let's put that out there. Uh, she was an instigator and a dumb instigator at that. Like, there's this one part where it's like she's citing the Articles of Confederation. You know, the thing the current U.S. Constitution replaced way back in the day. Uh... <laughs> Uh, and the the things she wor she the things she cited from the Confederation article thingy mabobs. Not only like she misinterpreted them, so she was like double wrong. Like how stupid are you? And then uh, that's not the best part. No, the best part was when uh, she started to get arrested. Oh gosh, need to dispel. Let's see, are they any close to each other? Uh, I probably can't get this. Eh, maybe I'll get it. I don't know. Oh, I got them both. Ooh, look at that. All right, guys, target this one. So anyway, she starts getting arrested, and she was like, "This is you are literally raping me." That those are her words. Like something, something, something literal rape. And I'm just sitting there thinking, "Oh boy," you know, I, not in any world, not in any way would I condone this. But, I mean, I'm just saying, hypothetically, I'm not saying it would be bad if she were to really get raped to give her some good fucking perspective on what literal rape is. I mean, I'm not condoning it, I'm just suggesting that maybe that would give her some better perspective. Uh, cause holy shit, that's a dumb bitch. Uh, bye Felicia, have fun in jail. I wonder where, I wonder where that person is, uh, these days. Cause, uh, man, that was, a. Uh, a good video, and uh, I, I mean, top, for topping the cringe chart, it's just probably right underneath hell, uh, Life is Strange. I was about to call it Hella is Strange, but that would just be incorrect. Um, oh hey, I just energized the shadow of this, and then grabbed the fireball to grab the thing that's nearby. I don't remember where it is, though. Let's see, what's in here? Hmm. Let's see, Ferelden Scout Hat. Sure. Actually, I don't know, uh, I really don't know where the, uh, the thing is. Lyrium Falls. Oh, I actually did want to kind of read that. Let's go check over here. I have a feeling it's over here. Just one of those feelings. Hey, Black Lotus, sure. Why not? I just have this feeling. I just have this feeling. Oh, yeah, Spider's going to spawn in as well. The fuck is it? Damn it! I lost it! Yeah, I don't know. Maybe I'll have to check the other side. So let's go, just go, let's just go with these shards first. Some of the shards are actually right in here. <clears throat> uh, boom, boom. Oh, the third one's probably right behind me if I remember correctly. Yep, there it is. Look at that. Too strong. Uh, insert humble brag here about I knew that was there. And I love being right all the time. All right. Uh, so anyway, oh, there is another video, and this one is actually let's, a guy got shot in the face for not taking off his seatbelt. 
How fucking dumb is that? Oh, and the best part is the cop who did it, he recorded it with his body camera, and then he lied in his report! How fucking dumb are you? <laughs> oh, that was gold. I think, I don't remember if that guy got, like, fired or if he got sentenced to prison or not. I don't remember. There, there have been a couple of cases similar to that. What are you doing? You shooting a spider with your bow? Well, good job. Oh, no, I didn't want to cast a fucking shield on the enemy, okay? Man, if only they actually made it so he gave the shield to the enemy, though. I actually wouldn't mind that. It'd make me strategize more in this game that's supposed to be about strategy, am I right? One Bioware. <sighs> so let's see, anything else to say about that? Yeah, that guy's a fucking jackass. I don't, I don't know if the guy died or not, though. I don't remember. But that was really stupid. Like, sure. The guy could have cooperated more, but that doesn't warrant a shot in the face. Like, holy crap! Yeah, what the uh, what the cop said was uh, activate that. Oh, that reminds me. I need to go do that thing with Solus, right? In the hinterlands. Like in the video, you know, you, you see the cop like grab for the door and stuff, and the guy didn't take this a seat. This region is known for its pirate code. Be on the lookout. Oh yeah, I gotta worry about all the pirates in this area. So anyway, like, in the video, the guy wouldn't take his seatbelt off, the cop ended up trying to, like, open the door forcefully or something, I don't really know. It's been a while, I don't remember all the deets. But anyway, in the report, he said the guy was driving away from him and dragged him, and that's why he shot him. But the guy didn't start driving away until after he got shot or something, right? So it's like, what the fuck? Who put a stick up your ass, guy? Like, holy poopsicle. But anyway, if I can't find this, like... I know it's got to be somewhere close by. Like, I don't know why I can't find this one. It's kind of driving me crazy. You guys gonna just let the spider fuck me up like that? No? Good. Hey, Prophet's Laurel. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. I could use some of that, I think. Oh, hey, a seed! Cool, cool. Alright, guys. Now, where the fuck... Like, I know, I know I don't need it, but I really want it. It just really bugs me leaving something behind like that. Oh, I don't know if it was closer to the end... Oh, hey, another Prophet. Thingy, my Bob. Stop hitting me. I have things... Damn it! You made me drop my light! Fucking jerk. I was gonna let you live. Ugh. Now it's too late for you. It's not a damn shame. Yoink. Okay, guys, I fucking found it. I don't know how I missed it. I ran all along the side a couple of times. So anyway, it's right here. Uh, about halfway between the X and the cave symbol. Against the uh, wall that's facing south. A superb lightning rune. Something I will never use. Alright guys, so we are over here on the way to the... It's done. What? What's done? The fuck are you talking about, Cassandra? Okay, whatever. Sure, she's just talking to herself. Don't mind me. Have at it. Can't even see the other shore. That's... Far. The waking sea. We crossed it to reach Haven. Already it seems so long ago. Didn't you guys already have this conversation, oh, so like 50 hours ago or whenever we were here last? I do not know. It wouldn't surprise me. I know uh, in, in past experience, I've had... Well, one in particular was a conversation between Dorian... And maybe Varric. And they had the, they had the same exact conversation like five times in a row when I was walking around in a, a desert area. But what, whatever, that doesn't matter. So now, the next stupid thing to talk about... Some... Oh, some... Oh, some more dumb things people said. Let's see, uh... Let's talk about the Supreme... The Supreme Court's ruling on gay marriage! Oh boy, this is gonna be a great one. Oh man. I'm not gonna give a lecture or anything here. Oh boy, did some people say some dumb things. Uh, but first, I'm just gonna say, like... How fucking surprising is that, man? I mean, it was a 5-4 to four ruling. It was really close. But, uh, I never suspected that that would happen anytime soon. It's crazy. 
Um, but anyway, after that happened, you know, of course you got the, uh, I'm not gonna name any names, but, uh, <laughs> people losing their shit. Uh, be like, this is lawless! Okay. Sure, bud. Um, but anyway... Uh, oh man, this is, this is, I mentioned this earlier, where like, I saw this guy tweet, I don't know if he was a senator or something, but, uh, he tweeted that, uh, allowing gay marriage, uh, basically was as morally wrong as 9-11. Now, I'm not saying you have to agree with the gays and the whole gay marriage thing, but it seems like if you're gonna call, I don't know, gay marriage as bad as killing 3,000 people, you know, I just, <clears throat> I don't think you should be in politics. I mean, that just seems really fucking out there, um, and ridiculous. So let's see, what can we, oh, I gotta, I gotta walk all the way to this one. <clears throat> Here are some other good ones, though. Uh, there were people that were like, well, I guess we're moving to Canada now. Even though, you know, like this was because gay marriage was now, was now legal. But, um, here's the thing. <clears throat> you know it's been in Canada for like 10 years now? Hmm, I wonder if it's gay marriage. Gee. Yeah, have fun in Canada. Well, you'll get some, you'll get some better health care, sure. But, uh, if the whole reason for going there, um, is that fucking stupid that you don't, whatever. That's just really dumb. I don't like gay marriage. Stop moving to another place that also has gay marriage. Like uh, I don't, I don't need to tell you the flawed logic in that one. But uh, <laughs> you can't expect stupid people to know uh, very many things. Let's see. Oh, another one. This is one that gets tossed around a lot. A whole poop ton is uh, the whole redefining marriage thing. Because here's the thing. Well, one, govern our marriage is a government contract. It's not a religious contract. But here's the thing. <clears throat> you typically see uh, these Christian politi politicians uh, saying things like that. But here's the thing. I mean, marriage was around long before Christianity. And it was around, it was around before paganism. You know, the, you know, those paganism things that Christianity borrowed, so to say. Long before those. And guess what was before those? Well, gay people were around before Christianity, and so was gay marriage around before Christianity. So I don't understand, like, the, I, uh, these people, they don't, they don't know how to argue a point because they're, they don't have an argument when they're saying stuff like that. Let's see. Hmm. Here's a good one. Reli the religious freedom thing. Like, I mean, letting... Like, pe some people are under the impression that letting gay people get married is, like, somehow violating religious freedom. I don't understand that. It's like... I don't know. It'd be like saying it violates someone's freedom by letting people eat vegetables. Like, get the fuck out of here, guy. Like, um... It, it seems like f some of these people, though, when they say religious freedom, they mean, uh... They really mean... The freedom to tell others how to live, which is which uh, really drives me crazy, because we're supposed to have that little thing called, you know, separation of church and state. But you know, that's just a tiny detail. We don't need to worry about that. So you guys need help with that guy? No. All right, where's this hole? Oh. Right there. That's the end of it. Can I click on you? There you go. <clears throat> and I find it interesting, like um. The is salty here. Yeah, I feel like I've heard that conversation before, Sarah, as well. Um, but anyway, it seems like, you know, you, you can find a lot of hypocrisy with uh, some of these politicians. More especially in the, uh, the religious ones that want to pass religious laws. Which really grinds my gears. You shouldn't be passing religious laws, dude. Religious freedom, sure, but not laws that favor you because you're part of a religion. That's, uh, that's just not cool, man. Like, um... Like, I, I've seen some things where people were like... You know, they'll tout religious freedom. And the same people will be like, We gotta take down the Mormon temples and that satanic church monument. It's like, oh, aren't you a fucking hypocrite? How about you go kill yourself? Fuck, 
fucking asshole. I mean, come on, man. Religious freedom doesn't mean Christianity freedom to fuck others. That is not what it means at all. Ugh. It just really, 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 really grinds my gears. Let's see, what do we have next? What's that? I guess we can... Hmm. Alright, well, let's go get uh, this stuff. That Oh, whoops. Thought that would activate a quest, but it won't because that quest is already done. I really hope I didn't miss any bottles. I know there are a few in uh, the Hissing Wastes that I might fucking miss. I certainly hope not, though. I think there are like three or four there. So let's just go there. <clears throat> so what are some other dumb things people have said? <laughs> uh, but anyway, here's some backstory for this one. Um, anyway, there's like, uh, there are these military exercises that go on in Texas, right? And they've been going on for decades, right? But it was, it's, some people are under the impression that Obama wants to invade Texas because there are said exercises there. I guess because Obama's, oh man, you know, the, those, those comments were like, Obama's the, uh, evil communist Muslim, a uh, Muslim socialist who's trying to fuck our white girls or something like that. <laughs> it's like, oh man, Obama's trying to invade Texas, guys. Oh, no. That's, uh, that is something really special. Let's see, where's that fucking door? Oh, who are, who's over there? I'm not gonna fight them, whatever. Hello, guys. Just don't get sure with me. Thank you. Okay. Let's see. Oh, yeah, back to the gay thing, right? I love seeing the comments where it's like, you know, gays are responsible for the fall of Rome. And I find that a really odd one. Un especially odd, because it's like, basically what they're saying is, when they say something like that, they're basically saying that, like, gays are responsible for Constantinople falling, not the Crusades, not the Ottomans or the Turks. No, the gays did it. What were the were the were the, were the Turks gay or something? I don't fucking know. But it seems a little ridiculous to say the gays were responsible for the fall of Rome. Like that just doesn't happen. <laughs> oh shit. Oh shit. 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 I gotta go back. I don't. Ah, oh, there's there's something I always fuck up in this area. Got to loot a key. And I don't know if this guy had it. Yep, he did. I almost fucked it up. I remember fucking that up so many times. Like, I'll go through here, and I'll always kill, like, the first guy, and then I'll get all the way through it, but you need the key before you can keep going. And then I, I was like, where the fuck do I get this key? So I would walk all over the place. And it's like, boom, the guy who had the key was at the very beginning. It's like, gosh, that just pisses me off. Let's see. What's another one? Red Templars have dug in here. I'm certain King Alistair would appreciate having them removed from Ferelden's shores. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'm sure. Oh, here's a good one. Right on my list. Um. Uh. Oh, when was it? I don't remember when it was, but there was this Ramadan thing, right? Like, you know, the, the Muslim, uh. Would it be classified as a holiday or is it more of a. Uh, whatever. It doesn't matter. Anyway, during the Ramadan thing, like with Mecca and all that, you know, it's like all the people in Mecca praying to the bo the block. I don't remember what they, you know, you know that thing. Um, but anyway, this was in a Yahoo article. You definitely don't want to look at Yahoo comments. Uh, they can be pretty terrible. A lot of stupid shit. A lot of terrible things too. So anyway, there was this one comment where someone was like. You know, this is one of those traditional, they are, they fear every single Muslim in the universe. Oh gosh, I need to restart my recording. Let's see. Let's go place the stick first and destroy this thing first. <clears throat> uh, yoink. Dare, da Darwin's mouth. Cool, cool. Alright, so I think now would be also be a good time to save my game and then restart the thing. Uh, so... I will BRB and I will finish that thought that I was stating. <laughs>